All right, Creek students, I want to show you very quickly how to make a copy of a Google document uh, to keep track of all your license information for the photos you're going to gather on this project. Um, when you go to our Edmodo post, we have all these resources for you, and one of them is the Google Doc we're going to use to keep track of all our license information. All you have to do is click on that link, like I just did. It opens up the document, and then you are able to make a copy. Be sure you're logged in over here and make sure it's your login, not someone else's. When you're logged in, you'll go over to File, Make a Copy. It's going to open up a new window where you can put in your name. Just put your name in and leave that there. Do OK. And now it's opened a whole new copy of that Google document. And I'm ready to keep track of all of the information that goes with my pictures that I'm going to find. So I go down here, I've got my name to put in, homeroom, I have the targets to remind me, I have a link to the CC search where I'm going to search Flickr for my pictures, and then I have a handy place here to keep track of stuff. So if I go to CC search real quickly, and if I search for an image that I'd like to use in my collage, keep in mind I'm doing the world's ugliest things. These are pretty ugly, right? Okay, if I want to use this one, I want to keep track of the information about this. I first just want to make sure the license works for me. I see it's a Creative Commons license. It has two parts. Here's the information about the photographer and the title that they gave to it. I can just highlight this bit right here, and I can take this and copy it into my document. So the name of the image is budding cactus top the photographers Alan Levine I may want to be able to go back here and show other people I can go over to the right hand side this little arrow click on link it gives me a handy little link command C to copy it come back over here and command V now I have all the information about the photograph I want to go over and check the license it has two parts it has a person and that little share alike symbol I want to go over here and put in uh, X for the ones that I saw. I see two pieces and then I can use my card there to figure out what those two tell me together and decide will this work for my purpose. I want to make a new picture. I want to change it and uh, this one is not there. So that equal sign missing means I can make changes which means yes this will work. Now I've recorded everything about this image and I'm ready to download it and that's the next video for you.